What's up, everybody? So, I wanted to get this one on film. This is the uh, first big challenge that I really had since I started exercising three months ago. And it doesn't sound like much, but today's was uh, run for two, uh, 20 minutes or two miles. Uh, I didn't get two miles, but I got 20 minutes without stopping. And considering that when I started this back at the end of May, I could barely do one minute and then worked myself up to a minute and a half, three minutes, five minutes. And then last week's workout was eight minutes to make the jump from eight to 20, uh, a consistent jog without stopping. I'm pretty pleased with. So uh, I got a hell of a long way to go. But uh, I got a lot of uh, motivation. I got three kids and a wife to be healthy for and to keep doing this. And uh, I got Deeps out there killing it every day, uh, giving me a little motivation to keep it going. So hopefully uh, this thing keeps going right. And, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. But I wanted to hit this one up on video because it's a pretty big day for me. 20 minutes in a row. So hopefully uh, we keep it going. Peace. Okay, it's Food Friday. We made it. Uh, first though, I got five mile easy run today. Uh, super easy, I'm gonna recover. I'm not gonna take you guys with me. I just, I just wanna chill a little bit. But later, we got Food Friday coming up. This recipe is inspired by my sister, Vivian, who from Venezuela has brought us this wonderful recipe. Uh, very simple, very easy, very delicious. Gluten-free, we have arepas. All right, we're gonna stuff them with some turkey and some good stuff. So I will see you later, and please enjoy the recipe. Cue the jazz music. So the first thing we're doing, we got our turkey out, and we have it rested to room temperature and getting our oven set to 325. Uh, while that's going, we're gonna get our uh, spice rub together. We got a whole bunch of paprika, chipotle chili pepper, some onion powder, a little bit of dried thyme, some dried oregano, salt, pepper, and we're just gonna give that a little mix. Add whatever spices you want. Uh, we're gonna get this thing to like a paste-like consistency. So we're gonna add oil a little bit at a time and stir it up. We don't want this thing like a really wet marinade. It's gonna become just like a little paste. So mix that up. That's what you're looking for there. All right, we're just gonna give that uh, massage onto the turkey. All right, so don't be shy. All right, next we're gonna make our arepas. So we're gonna have, this is like a cup and a quarter or a cup and a half of masa harina. You can find that in the uh, health aisle. We're gonna add warm water to it until it comes out and kneads into a dough-like consistency. So add a little bit of a time until it gets to this point. Then just gonna break this up into quarters and then shape them into what I would call like hockey puck size. So I got my four arepas here. I'm just gonna give them a little drizzle of olive oil and uh, give them a little rub down. Into the frying pan, we're gonna go like five minutes on each side to get some color. So five minutes on one side, and then we'll flip them over. So that's what we're looking for. They should feel firm on the outside. Uh, once they're done, we're gonna put them into the oven where our turkey is and get our sauce ready, which is yogurt, a little bit of lime zest, 
and lime juice. That onion powder again. A little bit of the chipotle chili powder. Black pepper. Salt. And your hot sauce of choice. In this case, about like two tablespoons of Cholula for me. Give that a mix. All right, this is what your arepa should look like after about 10 minutes in the oven. All right, firm on the outside, really soft and steamy on the inside. So I'm just gonna get uh, my toppings together. Got some sliced onion, some sliced tomato, and then a slice of little avocado as well. Right. Turkey's out of the oven about, you know, 15 minutes to an hour. Check with a thermometer. It should be about 165. All right, let it rest for about 10 minutes. I'm going to pull this turkey apart. All right, I like doing this. Uh, usually this is like a pork recipe, like, and it turns into like pulled pork. You get all the juices back into that turkey. Okay, so we're gonna start putting this together. Cut open a arepa. I like to put my uh, toppings actually on the bottom here. So tomato, a little white onion. We're gonna start layering up some spicy turkey. Don't be shy with this. All right, load it up. slices of that avocado we sliced up. And then finally drizzle over that hot yogurt sauce. But it's somehow, some way, find the means to put the lid on the top of this. Spicy turkey arepa. Not quite traditional, but healthy. And definitely a big healthy meal. Actually home already. That was an easy five miles. Uh, the pace for these things are getting easier. Um, if I could just lock into that pace for tomorrow, I think I'll be pretty set on a good long run. So, got. Good food Friday. I hope you guys enjoyed the arepas. Try the recipe out. Let me know what you think. Uh, I'm going to eat a bunch of them. Definitely. I'm definitely going to eat a bunch of them. Fuel up for tomorrow. And hopefully I'll see you there. It's going to be a good one. Happy running, guys.